Hey guys, today we have an unboxing from the cubicle. This has two cubes, the somewhat new Waylong GTS and the GANS 356S version 2. Uh, so let's just get straight into it. Alright, this is the Waylong GTS. And this is the GANS 356S version 2 business card with a QR code on the back and stickers. Alright, so I am most excited for the Waylong GTS, so I'm going to save that for last. So let's start off with the GANS 356S V2. This is the advanced version, as you can see right here. Um, I didn't feel that it was necessary to get the master version because I wasn't interested in all the extra stuff it had. Alright, so it has a nice golden logo on it. Um, it feels like it wants to turn. These stickers are pretty nice. I did get replacement stickers for the blue and orange, which do look like the ones that I'm going to need a replacement for because I'm not a huge fan of these. But uh, let's get in first turns. Hmm. So it does. It feels really nice. It's really smooth. Uh, no real turning problems out of the box, but it does feel a bit flimsy. I think that's going to get better with tensioning. Uh, but other than that, I really do like the smooth feeling that it has and the nice turning. Corner cutting about 45, maybe a little over, and reverse. Oh wow, reverse is really good. That's incredible. On to the Waylong GTS. And then it has this cool box, which really has no purpose. Okay, looking at this cube, it's a little bit dusty. Uh, let's get into first turns. Wow. <laughs> this is really good. Alright, so this is feeling really nice out of the box. Uh, it feels really crispy, um, sort of crunchy, and very smooth. It feels nothing like the original Waylong. It's super fast as well. I feel like this could be really good for one-handed. A little bit flimsy for one-handed, though. But yeah, this is turning out really well so far. Uh, let's check out corner cutting. Wow, that's really good. Reverse. Also really good. Not quite as good as the GANs, though. Uh, but it does seem to flow better than the GANs. So yeah, this definitely has main potential for me. And this cube, after I work with it a bit, might also have uh, main potential. I guess we'll just have to see after a while. So I'm going to do some solves on these, and then I will post a few at the end of this video for you to watch. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!